Welcome to Drawn in 60 Seconds, where I give you a rapid run-through of a topic in history. Today I'm going to explain four consequences of the Black Death which swept Eurasia and North Africa in the mid-14th century. Historians believe that the Black Death killed an estimated 45-60% to 60 of Europeans, and as much as a third of people living in the Middle East. There were so many deaths that mass graves were the only way to effectively deal with all the bodies. For decades after the Black Death, disrupted supplies and scarcity of commodities, among other things, caused massive inflation, so that the purchasing power of wage labourers took a nosedive. Having said this, because of population decline, greater opportunities for peasants to demand higher wages in return for their services were presented. Although these wages rarely overcame inflation, some have argued that power began to shift from landowners to workers, thus weakening the feudal system. The number of deaths and the inability of prayer to help led some to the conclusion that either God was punishing humans or that certain groups within communities were somehow responsible. This often led to thinly veiled resentments coming to the surface, leading to the tragic persecution of those held responsible, from Jewish people to foreigners to the sick. 